Hey what's going on guys, it's me Ellie and today I am here with some quick news. To start with I want to talk about the Summer Game Festival 2021. Uh, recently they have just announced um, a new game event that is going to happen on June 10 where they're going to reveal tons of new games and just uh, some already revealed games. And they have also just teased a quick uh, video about what kind of games and what companies are going to be revealed in their summer game festival by just showing a bunch of short clips of games as a teaser. And among all of these clips, you also see a quick clip of Outworld Soulstorm. What? Wait, what is going on? Oddball Soulstorm is going to be in Summer Game Festival 2021? But why? Oddball Soulstorm is already released! Well, what else could they reveal in, in this festival? I don't really know, but all I can think of is they're either doing this to advertise the game even further despite the game already being released, or they could probably reveal something new for Artwell Souls or maybe a DLC but I highly doubt it. The game was just released uh, almost uh, one month ago so I, I don't know about that but just in case so you know. Now another thing I want to talk about is in a recent interview with Lorna Lining, the creator of Artwell, he talked about Munch and Stranger potentially returning for future Oddball games with new roles instead but he also pointed out that they have so far not worked on new games or they are not working on some new Oddball games yet before they need some finances before they can do that and we still don't know when they are gonna begin or if they ever, ever will begin with this. Another thing he also talked about is a potential movie or a TV show about Oddworld. Actually he did actually talk about a um, potential movie way way back at the beginning of the development of Oddworld Soulstorm but he mentioned that if Soulstorm succeed he's thinking about making a movie but for this I'm with it it's not really a promise, but it's, it was just something he thought about. Now, last thing I want to talk about is he has also ranked all of the Oddball games by his own opinion, and it seems like his favorite Oddball game is Oddball Soulstorm. And just to give a short explanation of why the rest of the games are ranked low is simply because, like, it was just so hard. For him and his team back then, just creating these games, that he just faced lots of issues, and he, most of all, he just couldn't really turn these games into this, this version he always wanted to make. So, with Artful Souls, he was so just so proud of it. He, it was literally this version of um, Ape Six that he just always wanted to make, and then he successfully made it. So. So yeah, that's all for today and thank you all for watching and I'll see you all next time. Bye.